Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. This will be part 16 of our Let's Play. In the last episode, we secured the loyalty of... Uh, who's its face? Uh, Zaid. By going after the Blue Suns boss or whatever. And we got some more upgrades. I'm pretty sure in the end of the last episode we chucked them all on. E Ooh, not quite. No, we got that one. Which will let us get the cane. Which is just like a nuke launcher. Which is pretty fun. So we're definitely going to bring that. Um, and as I was like starting this up, Kelly did tell me that Jack wants to talk to me. So it's probably time for her loyalty mission as well. Do we have any unread messages? Nope. We dealt with that. There you go. So we have to go down to engineering anyway. Because I want to go and talk to Zaid. Just, you know, just in case. Because he probably has more dialogue for us anyway. So let's see what Zaid has to say. Well, I mean, maybe he has more dialogue. We don't know. Uh, Zaid? Thinking about no. Past missions. Got a minute. You might learn something. Tough fight on horizon. Mm, okay. I Whatever. Like I also want to talk to Grunt. That's okay. I didn't really ask. No, it's fine. Shepherd. I'm talking about just you. Checking it, making sure you're a I was just <laughs> Ah, here we go. You're thinking the picture. Huh? I'm finally starting to get it. There's a tank imprint, the Battle at Canrum, a dead Turian stripped. You don't see them out of their armor much. A Krogan boot on his head and a claw hammer. It's under the brow plate, pulling it back, right? You wouldn't think if they're like the peak of physical conditioning that they'd have three fingers. You think they'd have more? You can feel it ready to snap. I get it. Maybe I need some context. What's can can room? Isn't ringing a bell. Death of Shiagar, female warlord. Turians killed her, so they were hunted down and made examples. Even if they won the war. Fair enough. The last push before the rebellions ended. Okay. Why is that Maybe funny? Maybe I had to be there, but I don't get the joke. <laughs> I had to be there. There's no joke. It's just great. It's a Turian, and he's being torn apart for what they did. Okay, fair. I, felt nothing I can appreciate before. some justice. Now I get it. It was a good fight. The enemy was destroyed to punish them all and send a message. I get it. I hate Turians. <laughs> I thought you'd be glad. I... What about Garrus? Don't start anything with Garrus. I won't have trouble on my ship. I don't hate Garrus. I hate the Turians. Garrus is just one. Okay, I mean, he's your honestly, guy. that's a pretty reasonable he's expectation, though. As he turns on me, it's hate, but it's mine. Okir was blind, and he tried to make me the same. But I'm starting to feel what they did, to see why I should care. Anyway, I'm still figuring where I fit. Okay. But it no, like, what a sensible. Opinion to have, basically. He hates Turians. Garrus is a Turian, but he doesn't hate Garrus, because I like Garrus, so he must be okay. But just the Turian race, he's not a fan. All right, Jack, talk to me. What do we got? Thoughts like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. Sure, you could put some clothes on though. Just saying. Not that I don't hate the uh, the nipple strap. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes. I'm listening. I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man, never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember... Is Cerberus is, like, really decentralized, from what I understand, though. Like, they all kind of do their own thing. Like, the elusive man is the boss, but he's not... He, he doesn't, like, keep track of everything, he just kind of funds it. Every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. Uh... How'd you escape? There was some kind of emergency, and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. Interesting. I just killed everything in my way and ran. Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground. Drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me, then sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. Fair enough. You're sure it was Cerberus? Absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility. I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. <laughs> Fucking idiots. I'll confront them. I'm gonna talk to the elusive man, and he'd better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. 
That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pravia where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb and I want to watch from <laughs> orbit when it goes. You know what? Why not? Let's go. I'll set a course for Pravia. I owe you, Shepard. Like, you know what? Seems reasonable. She doesn't want to, like, hunt down the people that did it. She doesn't want to do any of that. She just wants to go where all the bad things happen and make it disappear. Like, sounds relatively healthy to me. Uh, we do have a bunch of these to do. Maybe we should talk to Morden as well. Because I don't think we've talked to Morden yet. Does Morden want to talk to me? Kelly? I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Oak here. I get the feeling that yeah, she doesn't it's fine. How's the group? Is there anything I should no, anything else? I'll be here if you need Okay, so no one wants to talk to me, but maybe Morden just wants to talk about his past and not necessarily like his loyalty thing. Shepard, how can I help? You got a minute to talk. later. Updating crew oh, dental okay. records. All Cerberus personnel have cyanide capsules and molars. Primitive ocular nerve flashbangs harder to disarm. Anything else? We'll ocular nerve flashbangs. I guess you just, like, overload the brain by overloading the ocular nerve. It sounds pretty horrible. <laughs> but probably effective. Probably effective. Okay. So... We have a few loyalty missions to do. So we can go to Pragia and blow up Watsy's Watsy. We can go to... What is it? Ilium for Miranda? Or we can go on a wild goose chase for Jacob. Now, Ilium, we do have to go to anyway for recruiting missions. So maybe we we ignore that for the moment. Let's go and do Jax. Might be the way to go. I don't know. It's as good as any. But I feel like we should just wait for Miranda's because we're going to go there anyway. So it can be the last one we do. So let's go after Jack's one. We're going to go to our little cell. We're going to blow it to the moon. I don't think space has a moon, but we're going to blow it to Earth's moon. That's how big it's going to be. And again, I think that's perfectly reasonable. She's not being like a proper psychopath and just trying to hurt other people like she was hurt. Oh, I don't hate that as a uniform. Actually, sorry. I just want to like cycle the... Uh, that one. Bleh. Yeah, nah. I like the red. Sorry, yeah, I'm just like cycling these real quick. I can do with the red as well. Um, okay, so she's all biotic-y. I feel like maybe we bring Garrus, because he's a bit soldiery and a bit techy. So that's a good squad. Like, that's a rounded out squad. Uh, oh yeah, Shockwave is a very good one. Um, yeah, we're going improved. Get a nice wide hit. Oh, yeah, warp ammo. Oh, I forgot that's a thing. Shit, I will probably end up getting that. And we'll just level up her pull as well, because she's all about the biotics. I don't see why we would, like, get rid of... I don't know, see why we change that. Um, do you want to upgrade Incinerate? Or do we want to upgrade Tactical Cloak? I don't think we're going to use Cloak that much. We might even wait for Operative, I think. So I think that's okay. We will definitely use the Cane. Locust Carnifex Mantis is all good. Matok Mantis is fine. Geth Plasma Shotgun's garbage. So let's go for the Katana. And the Phalanx is pretty garbage as well. Just go for the Predator. It's a classic. How much I hate this place. It's just a mainline shooty pistol. See the landing pad has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up Wouldn't most landing pads be on the roof? Mm, I guess that's not true. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last. Assholes. <laughs> it was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. We're going in. We start a mission. We finish it. Yeah. Okay. Let's get on the ground. Let's do it. Don't question it. We're going in. We're going in.
I like the multi-culture pals. Jack, aren't you cold, though? I guess it's raining out. You'd just be getting all wet. Doesn't sound appealing. Uh, oh, actually, I'm kind of okay with this. Oh, yes. Yes. Uh, we won't use it just yet, but I'm excited. Uh, freeze the ammo, which we give to everybody. Is there anything up here? Uh, I don't think so. Let's get in there. It's even got a nuclear radiation symbol on the back of it. That's how you know it's good. I never saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They were messed up and starving, but alive. Uh, we won't go down there. Cool. Block terminal. We know how to do these now. Uh, we want... That one, and... Bum, 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 that one, and... Uh... That one. Here it is. It's just gonna be money. Yeah, okay, it's just 3,000 credits. 3,000 credits are still good, though. And eventually we're gonna have to go back to the Citadel and buy all the stuff that we haven't bought. But we can wait. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. Eh, turn it off. I don't care. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. Didn't really say anything. I switched it off really quick, but it's fine. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Okay. A bit less healthy. Like I'm all for this if it's if we just go in here to destroy things, but I don't really need the commentary on how many people you've killed. You know, it's one of those things like, I know she's a criminal. Don't need it in my face. You know, I get it. You've killed people. You're a crazy bitch. Whatever. Just, just uh, chill out a little bit, hey? I hear beasties. We've been spotted. I forgot that you fight Varen in this one like everywhere. This looks like an arena. That's sure, right. if you say so, Shepard. Stage fights here. Pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. Nature of the fights. Did children die in these fights. I was a kid filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. So yes. Products flooded my veins when I attacked. They actually rewarded you for attacking. I still get warm feelings during a fight. Nice. Uh, I don't really care about how much or why. Let's just go. Not important information. I know some people might be triggered with how I'm playing this, but like I've played it before. I don't want to play everything. Like I don't want to go through all the dialogue options. If you like the game, play it yourself and experience it. It's really good. Interesting. Understood. I'll begin the That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Mm, maybe there was more to it. You didn't see. The other kids attacked me, the guards attacked me, the automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. Well, apparently you were drugged out of your mind when you started fighting things though, so this you know. This is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a fresh kill. And maybe they killed each other with guns. I don't know much about Varen culture. You know. Who, who knows? Maybe they had an honorable duel and they both lost. I don't know. Maybe they were fighting for mating rights. Again, don't know much about Varen. Oh well, that's an arena. Oh, the blood pack's here. Never mind. Never mind, there's definitely bad shit going on here. Oh, I think I'm remembering this one. Uh, I think I am vaguely remembering this.
Now I'm gonna call it here. This was a small facility. I'm saying some sick son of a bitch killed a lot of kids with these experiments and then checked his work. Bullshit. I had the worst of it and I made it out alive. I th I'm gonna call it because I vaguely remember, but I don't know for certain. I think these guys were like hired by one of the other kids to come back or something like that. And do basically what Jack's doing or something like that. Oh, I don't remember. I don't think these guys are from, like, Cerberus. I don't think they were hired by Cerberus to come back. I think this is, like, a private... private matter. I'm basing that on very, very rough memories. I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch. But then I'm a little girl again. Shit. It's complicated. Let's just go through it. Nice try, guys. Almost a good ambush. Right, we'll just wait for the other one to unfreeze and hop back up. There he is. There he is. Okay. Baron time again. Fair enough. Not as scary as they look. Uh, some of these have to have stuff in them, right? Here we go. Soho boards. Nice three grand. Sure, just circuit boards, I guess. Mm hmm. This it's a two way mirror. My cell is on the other side. I could see all the other kids out here. Fair I enough. I at them for hours, and they always ignored me. Ah, this I looks must good. Have come through here when I broke out, but I don't remember it. This is a bad nothing place. on this side. But I saw a million things on this side, like some power cells, and another security log. What does this one say? Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. Interesting. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects. But no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect. So it's like trying to make super biotics, I guess. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. So they're using all the other kids as like practice for her and test subjects. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. Makes sense. This place was built to turn you into what you are. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. Mm, find strength in it. Move on. Harder and tougher. Moving. Oops. Affirmative. I'm with you. Yeah, like who's to say it's not both? It could be both. Uh, that one, that one, and that one. Ah, these are two quick hacks we've had so far that just we smashed out. Biotic damage, of course. Doesn't really help us. But I think it affects all the teammates, so probably worth it. Gentlemen, fancy seeing you here. Hey, Arash, it's Kirin. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, put him down. Then I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. Why are you, what are you here? here? First, we're gonna kill you. Then, we'll see. Hmm, fair enough. <laughs> Would you like to try my new claw launcher? <laughs> Works pretty well. <laughs> oh. Oh, how I missed this thing. Although you get one shot out of it. I think you get two shots if you max out the, like, heavy weapon ammo upgrades. I think. You may not even get that. You may get, like, one and almost two shots. Still, that was effective. That was a very short, what I'm assuming is supposed to be, like, the ultimate battle. The final battle for this 
this loyalty mission and we just oh, just literally let off a mushroom cloud in in the middle of the arena and killed everything. I like it. You just guy on the radio is like that was a really big explosion. <laughs> I'm sure they're fine. Come out. We know you're here. How do you do, final person? Who are you? My name is Aresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Yeah, he was drawn here just like you. Back here, Jack. I tried to forget this, but a place like this, it doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost... Yeah, so I was right. Ago. I thought we so. I, it just came ideas. back to me. I'm gonna find out what they knew. How to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. That seems like a bad it idea. Be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You started again? Same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. Okay. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. I don't Just think that's how that works. Enough. Yeah. Are you nuts? You lived it. How did you escape? This place was like a prison. How did you get out? Probably the same time Jack we did, I assume. We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something! Dad, uh, no. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Sure. That. Yeah, killing him yeah, changes nothing. His past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. Yeah, but we're gonna blow it up. Crazy, and he's never gonna restart this facility. Yeah. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. That's right. Fuck. He literally That's said, like we said, know. we're gonna blow this place up. What do we do about you? And he's like, it's just leave me here, easy. like. None of it is. If let's finish up. Let's plant the bomb and get up. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Take your time. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. Although I am a bit more concerned that we let him get away, though. Probably would have actually left him here to blow up with the facility. He sounds crazy. I pound and yell. Don't want someone like that out there. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. Well, it's going to be nothing to come back I to. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. I'm sorry about it. All right. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Seems that way. No more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Oh, it just does automatically. Cool. Is it bad that I really hope that other guy didn't escape? And that he's just gonna blow up? Yeah, faster, please. Man, we... We did flatten the place by the looks. 
Alright, mission summary. Facility on Pragia confirmed destroyed. Concerned that previous cleanup crew failed to destroy all records. Surviving facility scientists already dead, either from uprising or after facility shutdown. Jack should have no further emotional issues distracting her from the mission. And now we have warp ammo, which is pretty great. It's basically just ammo that is better at everything. So we will probably take that as our special squad power, rather than the flashbang. Because flashbang's kind of shit. Uh, we don't really need it. And warp ammo will give us three options for ammo, which we probably won't use. We'll probably just use cryo and warp. We may even use more warp than cryo. To see you. Can do. So we're going to get a new loyalty mission for uh, more than now. But first of all, uh, what is it here? Biotic. Yeah, so it is a squad bonus, so I will definitely use it. It is always worth squad bonuses. And duration, why not? We are running out of element zero, though, which is... Worrying. Oh wait, hang on, it's here, isn't it? It's prototypes, it's uh Yeah, sure, why not? Uh but it is is it advanced training? Single bonus power yeah 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 And it is warp ammo. Yes. We are definitely running out of element zero now. Important news. No, you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Okay. Too important to wait. Just receiving data, still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You remember our talk? My work on genophage modification? Uh, yeah, I remember. Stop the Krogan adaptation to the genophage. Part of a team. Scientists, all different types. Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member. Malin, last seen on Tuchanka, might torture him, make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. Then know what you, you did? You found out your team updated the genophage? Unclear. No way to determine until we get to Tuchanka. I'll do what I can. We'll go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pact. Talk to them or Clan Chief. Yeah, I know an Erdnot. I remember an Erdnot. A yeah, good friend Erdnot. Big Erdnot. Strong Erdnot. No messages for you, Commander. Uh, does Grunt want to talk to me, though? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, whoops. No, just... How's crew? Okay, so Grunt doesn't want to talk to me. That's cool. We don't have any new messages. No, they did say that. Right. Now well, we move on to the next place. Which, I don't know where we should go now. Okay, we won't... Do any more recruitments yet? We'll stick to loyalty missions and side missions. Maybe we just go and help Jacob. Or we can investigate Project Overlord. Maybe we do that. Let's do this. This will be fine. Uh, yeah, we'll fall on fuel. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Because we can get this started now, and then come next episode, we can just, boom, straight into it. Which I'm pretty sure this is DLC. Pretty sure Overlord is DLC. Actually, we may even get part of the way through it. We got through Jax pretty quickly. So we have a bit of time left. As usual, not that it means anything. We have as much time as I want, but I usually try to keep it around 30 minutes or so. Cool, so she's loyal. Can we give her some clothes? We sure can. We can give her lots of clothes, actually. I don't like the glasses, but definitely just like the get rid of the weird bondage strap thing. All for that. Uh, right, two team members. Do we bring our boy... Let's bring Miranda. Yeah, we'll bring Miranda, and we'll bring... We'll bring our boy. I'm always happy to bring our boy Garrus. Uh, operative. Boom. We will probably take Agent. Uh, meh, 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 meh. No. Probably Agent, because it increases our Paragon Renegade score. Which is kind of more important for story reasons than, than the other. Um, probably Overload is okay. Oh, shit, maybe not. Crap, I already went over it. Whoops. 
then I guess we'll just upgrade Terrain Rebel. We'll just max that out. Uh, and we'll go Renegade. Increases weapon damage, sounds good. We will obviously bring the M920 Kane because that thing whew, does work. It does serious work. Oh, okay. Here's the Firewalker that we haven't used yet. I hope we don't actually have to use it. No, we don't. Thank God for that. Interesting. Okay, I know I have... I know I have warp ammo now. Well, no, okay. I'll use warp ammo, everyone else can use cryo. Oh, look at the blue purple bullets. I do also like the purple bullets. Do we get a full... Ah, oh, we do get a full reload on that. Nice. So you can basically use it once per mission for free. Which is pretty great. Yeah, I, I know I see it, but... You're not a satellite dish. They're geth on the loose. That's not a VI takeover. That's geth. That's a very different thing. That's a very different thing. Okay, I'm already concerned about this. I already have much concern. Sure. Now oh, the camera does watch me. Get rid of that. And that. I guess we're going this way. No, can't destroy that. Okay. Mm, that is really a horrible noise. Stop watching me. I'm just gonna say, I'm not seeing a lot of Geth bodies. I see a lot of people bodies. Did you even put up a fight? Sure. I don't even know if that's doing anything, but it makes me feel good. Yep, that's glass. Bulletproof glass, apparently. Oh god. Ow. Ooh, Geth Destroyer. They're kind of spooky. I do miss the cryo rounds, I will say. It is nice to be able to stun lock people. Like, the warp shots are arguably just better. Sir? Okay, don't even come around the corner then, it's fine. Oh god. Someone target that one, someone target that one. Uh, have some fire. Okay, well, I'm still not used to how that works. I know it, like, curves if you do it right, like this. But I'm just not very good at doing it right at the moment. Ah, fire! Thank you. Thank you. Maybe the double overload was not too bad. Seems to be working for me. Seems to be working for me. Anybody left? Geth boys. Thank you. Glad you made yourself known. Anybody else? Sure is. Ow. Ow. I don't want to be here anymore. Engaged. 
There we go. You know, okay, the warp rounds are pretty good. Ah, they're... Shit, I think they were stuffed downstairs. I should probably go check it out. And actually, we can probably just stop here. So, guys, while I'm checking this stuff out, we are going to leave this episode here. So, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see more content from me, the Aussie Nerd, feel free to subscribe to my channel and check out the other videos on there. If you think you know any friends might enjoy my content, make sure you share a video too with them. I really appreciate it. And finally, if you want to leave any hints, tips, tricks, feedback of videos, or you just want to say hi, make sure you do so in the comments section down below so I can see it. And I'll see all of you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.